and refers to me as Mr. Garson. <laughs> Matt, you're up. What a guy. <laughs> Thanks, Daddy. <laughs> Mom, since the day I met you at the Cleveland airport in 2008, you have been nothing short of welcoming, warm, and caring. You are an amazing grand to my kids and an incredible mom, advisor, partner in crime, and confidant to Blair. To be clear, when I say confidant, I don't mean that anything remains confidential. I've come to learn there are no secrets in this immediate family, and I witness this often. If Annie tells Kat a secret, and specifically instructs her not to tell Blair or Mom, Kat will of course agree, and immediately call Mom, who will then call Blair. <laughs> Everyone knows everything within a 37 minute window. And the most ridiculous part is they all know they act this way. I don't understand it, but that's a topic of conversation for another time. Mom, your roles with me are a bit different than yours with Blair. You play more of a tiny, pirate-sounding, cackling mother-in-law who repeatedly encourages me to buy diamonds for Blair. You can stop. I get it. Besides, Blair reminds me too. You also play a pretty large role in my marriage. When Blair and I got married, I naively assumed that we would make decisions together about life, our kids, marriage, etc. Little did I know that you and Blair make a lot of the decisions before I weigh in. For example, recently Blair and I were discussing landscaping. After Blair made a suggestion, and I agreed, Blair said, good, my mom thinks so too, so that's what we're doing. I'm honored to share my marriage with you, and there's no one else I'd want my wife to make decisions about my life with. Now having, now having officially been in the family for seven years and in the general picture for 10 years, I am extremely impressed and even more so grateful that you are still standing after dealing with these Looney Tunes we call family. <laughs> Cheers to the next 70 years being even better than the last. And yes, I expect you to be around for the next 70 years to help. I love you and happy birthday. How about this guy, huh? Our oldest daughter, Annie Orchin. You're up. Come on, Annie. 